Hi, everybody, along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Welcome to Toronto. Razor win two original six teams hook up. You spent some time with one original six team. Do you feel that sort of energy? You do, because everybody seems to have a little more investment. I'm not just talking about the players, but the media, the people that cover the games, the fans that come to the games as well. Great energy both inside and outside the arena tonight as we are just moments away now from puck drop. The Canadians take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Musa quickly over to Gallagher. That's turned away with the pad by Sam Sodov. Quick feed to Gallagher. There's another stop. Right spot makes the double save. Positioning does it all. Couldn't complete the pass. Nice pass. And that pass is redirected. Montreal's got the puck against the boards. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Takes the feed from his netminder. Violent collision. He moved in quickly. If you go at that pace, you take away all the available ice. Montreal's got the puck. Here's a short pass to Gallagher. Puck picked up by Nylander. Into the offensive zone. Oh, somebody get the smelling salts after that. Yeah, sending a message early there, James. He gets the body contact. The Leafs gain control of the puck. Slides the puck over. Looking to make something happen along the boards. The Canadians have it from their own end. Moves it to Hoffman. There's another for the hit parade. Keeps hold of the puck. He scores! What a goal! That's a good shot. He zips it by the goaltender, but he works himself into a clean area on the ice to shoot this from the high slot. The Canadians tally the game's first goal. When you get yourself into the middle part of a period, this is where the game starts to take shape, and now they've got the lead. Matthews wins the draw. Cutting to the front of the net. Fantastic save! Montembeau's made some unbelievable saves over his career. That's one of them. I mean, just throw it in the bin with the others. This is a great save of his quickness and positioning to keep the puck out. Directs it on over to O'Reilly. Nice zone entry from the middle. Here's a chance, fires the wrist shot. Montembeau's gonna cover it up for a faceoff. While his team's ahead, he wants to make sure the pace of the game stays at the level they like. Our replay is gonna show this is a pretty good shot, but the goalie uses the stick to turn it aside, using all the equipment available for the save. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. one nothing the score. Takes the feed. Slides it across to Korianov. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Achari. Toronto's got the puck. Angles it over to Yarncroke. The Leafs take it along the wall. Quick pass to Hall. Sends a pass over. Takes it to the net. Decides to think about it, and he makes the save. Toronto's got possession of the puck. The Leafs have it in the offensive end, and the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Moves it quickly over to Kerfoot. And that's knocked aside with the stick by Dvorak. Rips it. Quick stop by Montembeau. Gets the puck over to Korianov. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. The Leafs gain possession in their own end. Long reach breaks up the momentum. The first 20 minutes of this one is all said and done with as the horn sounds. Montreal's got the start they wanted. They get on the board quickly and they take a 1-0 lead into intermission.
Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. are back at center ice and we are ready to get period number two underway. Toronto's won the draw. And now he moves it to Marner. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Suzuki. And there's the save. Brody's lugging the puck. Marner's swooping in on the attack. Shot in front. Oh, what a stop on the play. Gets all of it with the paddle. Quick feed to Suzuki. Off a stick and they can't connect. And makes the save. Toronto's in transition. Montreal's got the puck in their own end. Handles it along the blue line. And that's blocked. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. The Leafs gain control of it. The Canadians scoop it up along the boards. Gives them nothing in front. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Here he is from the slot. Oh, going wide. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Receives the pass. Maintains possession. Denied by the goaltender. He was locked in there. Gonna have to work a lot harder to beat him tonight, I guess. There's two excellent saves in a row. Takes the pass. Here's a shot. Denied by Samsonov. And that's deflected. Goes right to the crease. And the pull check. Oh, smart play. Tavares plays it along the wall. Snaps one on net, and the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Samsonov's always a battler, and here he makes a great save on this chance. Past the midway mark of the frame, Montreal's up one zip. The Canadians win the draw. Weidman's got it in the defensive end. Takes the feed from his own end. Poked away in the defensive end. The Leafs move the puck in the defensive zone. They go on the attack through center. Here he is in front. Simple stop by Montembeau. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. Here in the late goings of the period, 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Toronto's got it in the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by Montembeau. Looks to pass it to Kurianov. Levels him with the hit. Moves the puck up to Achari. Great poke check on the reach. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Takes it across the blue line. The Canadians have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Dismiss that chance. Montembeau's done it again. Another terrific save, and he's kept this game close. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Suzuki's won a big draw on their own end. Sends the pass over. Montreal's in now. The Leafs with one last gasp before the period runs out. From the slot, wrist shot. Stones up with the blocker. Busted up on the play. Now you get in the right spot. Sometimes the thing just hits you. And that'll do it for period number two. One nothing is where we sit, setting up what should be a dramatic third period. The 
third period is just around the corner. Ray and I will bring you all the action in a moment. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Toronto's won it. Slides the puck across to Tavares. Nice zone entry from the right side. Montreal's got the puck against the wall. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And now he angles it across to Savard. And that's off a stick. The Leafs look to start the transition game. Toronto's got the puck against the half wall. That goes wide. Here's a short pass. Look out. Suzuki's done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. And he denied that opportunity. Sharp reaction save. And that's poked away by Tavares. Montreal's got a hold of the puck now. Shoots it, and he comes up with it. Montembeau's got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. No, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, we got a 1-0 game to this point. Toronto's won the draw. Denies him with the pad. Somehow the shooter got loose in the slot, but the goaltender's equal to the task. That's a good save. The Leafs take possession in the defensive end. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Stays with it. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Nice feed from the right wing. To the front. He scores! They tie it up! Well, they've been working hard to get this game back to level. And that goal will do it. You've got to get rid of that puck in a hurry from that spot on the ice. You're in the high slot, you're open, but you know everybody's converging on you. The Leafs have answered back with a huge goal here in the middle stages of this third period. It's always dangerous when you chase the game, but now that you've leveled it off, you feel good entering into the last stages of period three. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Matthews. Hoffman's got it into offensive territory. Puck scooped up by Hall. Well, a challenge being laid here. Montreal's got the puck now. These games used to drive me crazy. As somebody that was supposed to score, there'd be chances all over the place. You'll wait for one goal or two goals that crack the game open. They never seem to come. The chances are there. The production is not. Drives it to the crease. Oh, off the post. Toronto's got to feel a little unlucky here. Off the post, and the game's still tied. Another stop by the goaltender. They work the puck into a scoring spot, get a pretty good chance on goal. They just can't find a way to finish it off. Toronto's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Thunderous hit, oh my! Yeah, that one hurt me over here. That is an enormous hit. He closed the gap in a hurry. The Canadians take possession of the neutral zone. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Monaghan's got it against the boards. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Wow, he's dialed in right now. That is an enormous save at this time of the game. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. The Leafs get a hold of the puck in their own end. Toronto's playing it through center. Driving right to the front. Off a stick. Picked up along the boards by Martin. Comes up with the stop. And there's the whistle as he elects to slow things down a little. A pretty good decision here with the play starting to break down in front of him. Marner's great at finding his teammates with passes nobody expects him to make, guys. His third 
high zone ability and his high hockey IQ allows him to make plays that nobody sees coming. The Canadians will play it in their own end. The Leafs gain possession. And that goes off the side of the frame. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. And he regains control of the puck. Takes the feed with the stop. Toronto's got it against the boards. Shoots it. Oh, what a stop by Montembeau. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. I can't think of a bigger time to make that stop. The game stays tied. Great save. Both teams readying here for the faceoff. Matthews has won the draw. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all... That's it! He scores! And the bench jumped right up. Both teams go. The longer you stay locked in the tie, luck starts to play a bigger part of the victory. The clock was ticking down pretty quickly, it seemed like, but they're able to break the tie in the last few seconds here. That's a big goal for them. Suzuki's one possession. Great reach with the poke check. Montembeau's at the bench, allowing for the extra attacker to jump on. There's icing, never a huge fan of it, but boy, at this time, talk about a critical call here. Well, and the interesting thing here, James, is somebody ices the puck, but now the pressure goes all onto the centerman to win the draw in the defensive zone so you don't burp up a scoring chance. The Canadians take possession off the faceoff. And he easily stops that one. And there's the final horn, bringing this one officially to an end. The Leafs were in a tight one tonight, but they found a way to win. What'd you see from their effort? Well, mostly that they had better legs. They had better legs because they had the puck more often. Way easier to be aggressive when you're always in possession of the puck. Well, the post-game salute to the fans. Do you like this? In my day, it would have felt awkward. Yeah. Now it just feels like part of it, like the way it should be. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray, I'm James, good night.